Hello, everyone. It's your boy No Kaneko, your perfect virtual feline friend, the preparer of good vibes. So today we are here on Fagrant Order to do a bunch of gacha rolls. Um, it's a bit late. I wanted to kind of do this video way earlier, but a lot has happened, and I guess this will be a video where I'm also talking about what I've been up to in the previous few weeks. But um, if you guys can't tell, this. But you see right now is actually recording of something, you know, some rolls I did weeks earlier. So I'm gonna go ahead and let it run and I'll kind of talk about what has happened. Um, okay, so let it go. And there you go. So yeah, so I haven't been streaming for quite a bit sometimes. And oh yeah, yeah, we've got like a surprise, like four star submarine right off the bat. But, um, yeah, uh, it's, yeah, I haven't been streaming. I haven't been like releasing any videos for a while. It's cause I was on a trip for a very really long time. Um, uh, well, really long time is really just a week. Right. But it's like at a period that kind of makes it feel like a really long time since I last done something. But yeah, it's mainly because I was um, at Anime Expo. At Anime Expo, they had, you know, a fake Grand Order panel. And so, what did I decide to do? I decided to do some pulls. So these are actually my pulls uh, during the time I was in an Anime Expo. I was like literally at like this little like booth they had where they had like a scabber on like a rock, a uh, bunch of like, other things around as well but yeah I guess I was not the only other person who was thinking about doing that there was a bunch of other people who were at the very exact same spot just doing a bunch of pulls <laughs> and but yeah anyways I was like I'm still gonna do it anyways and I'm gonna record it and then you know post it later and and you would think like you know after any expo this should video should be up right off the bat right but no it totally did, took like it's because as soon as i got back i got you know i realized i got some signs that i had a flu or a cold i'm pretty sure it's a flu more than a cold but uh yeah i was i had like a pretty bad sore throat and i was coughing so much and i was like oh, i cannot make a video all without it just sounding really bad so I just I just had to wait and postpone until I recovered and um, I'm still in the middle of recovery so I might sound a little bit off but for the most part it's I think I would say I'm like 70% recovered so it's enough for me to kind of um, Oh, continue to try to finally release this video, especially when, you know, a lot of these gacha summons are going to be going away soon. So I need to kind of get ahead up there. But yeah, so these, these are some of the summons I did. I did a bunch of single summons in the very beginning and then a couple of 10 pulls. And I was like, yeah, I'm going to do the rest of my pulls later uh, when I make this video. This is just an appetizer. Um, yeah, I had like, what, a good like 40, 40 tickets or something? Roll enough to, you know, hit that two times when you hit every 10 pull. Um, didn't get anything too crazy. I mean, I think I did get some of the new um, CEs from this gacha and the, the CE actually kind of surprised me a little bit. I was like, oh, that C is really good. The five star C is really good for, you know, a buster character, especially when it has most of the stats into attack. Just hear a roar. Where I just heard a roar somewhere, but I don't know where it came from. <laughs> I'm like trying to think of where it came. From. Anyways, so let's see. How far are we? We're, we're almost there to the end of it. So yeah, after I get most of my tickets all out of the way, I guess that was the first copy of the new five star C that I'm talking about. As you can see, it gives you uh, 
plus their effectiveness, crit, and you know, 50% MP in the beginning. So really good. I really like it, right? It makes it really good for, you know, what I'm trying to do with, again, you know, and try and attempt to bust their loop. Uh, especially when you get, you know, double Kionskia and Morgan Lafayette all together. So it's it what I like I at the same time um, I will be probably rolling for O'Brien a little bit. He did just came out today too, but it really all depends on how I do with um with more of the Kansky banner. As you 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 probably will be able to tell soon as. Or maybe I'll just wait until I, this video finishes first. So, as soon as, um... Really? Really? <laughs> it cut off! It didn't finish recording the whole thing! Uh, not only that I forgot the audio on in the video, but it didn't record the whole thing. But I think the big reveal at the end of the video was I actually managed to get the count skill on my second tenth pull. <laughs> this is this is such a big fail, but it's it's okay. I this is the reason why I'm gonna do a bit more pulls after this, anyways. Um, let me go ahead and switch to my actual screen instead of the video screen. Hmm. I just need to hide this, and there you go. Now we're back. So this is my actual screen. So, um, I didn't really intend to really go for the the CE, but. You know, after rolling that many tons for Kyonska, I, I got like three of that new CE. Yeah, I just need two more and we'll have it maxed out. So that's actually the main goal. And if I get any extra copies of Kyonska, that's nice. But um, let's see how it goes. Let's, um, I'm trying to figure out what I want to keep on spending my tickets. How many tickets do I have? That's single, which spends pay quarts, and I'm not trying to use that. But I do have a lot of tickets, so let's go ahead and start with the tickets first. Ideally, if you could, if I can get those five star CE without spend too many quarts, that'd be great. And when you, when you haven't stream or do, done any videos for a really long time, everything just feels kind of weird. Oh, that's a lot. I'm starting to skip you a little bit. That's uh, not my first copy of him. That's an extra copy. Either my like first or second copy of him. I mean by copy, you mean I mean by like extra, not the very first. He doesn't know what I mean. But anyways, let's see. I'll I'll try not to skip so much, but like if it's not gold, I'm definitely skipping it. So I'm trying to speed this up. FGO show something's gonna take a really long time to do. I'm not trying to stay here the whole night. Yeah, and most of the time it tends to be junk. Oh, and this is the, you know, the tenth pull, which gives you the second three pull, which is still nothing. Okay, I'm actually gonna do something. I'm gonna. Um, 
Okay, that was already 10 single tickets. I'm gonna go ahead and do a whole 10 pull. Okay, just making sure it's not using my paid cords. Paid cords I ain't been that I've sa been saving for ages on this account. Okay, go ahead and skip. And the nice thing about 10 pulls is it only shows you the very important pulls in the first place. And that's what we want to see. Just need one more and we're totally done. But right, there's still more. Assassin, it's an era Kabe Kionskia. My first 10 pull. Wait. Okay, I jinxed myself. <laughs> I did roll the right banner, right? I guess it's nice to get a new a extra copy. Not an extra copy. A new character. Wait a minute. This is This is crazy. What's going on today? Okay. Bakri. It's funny because I think you're a new character for me too. Bit of a surprise tonight, I guess. Hi, hi. Assassin no Sakabe Himi des. Ne, mo kaite hi kana. Dame? Ah, so. Okay, as they get you. Kotai me. Ortorinde des. Or your master's not human normally? That's right, because they normally serve gods, that's why. Yeah, in particular, like Odin. Hey, that's, um, that's cool. So I'm gonna go back to single pulls because now I just need, again, just one more copy of that Firestar CE. I'm just gonna speed run this. And it's very convenient, you know, to skip the 10 pulls and get exactly what you want, but I'm not trying to get too many extras and with the single summons I can stop as soon as I get it. So I don't have to spend any more extra that I have to. This kind of requires a little bit of focusing because uh to... there you go. Cool. Well because that all ended pretty crazily um I guess I have a bit more that I could actually try the summon for Oberon, but let me double check first. It's always good to check where you have exactly what you need. And I'm just going to go ahead and max it out. And just my mess, but this thing that I did not mean to do, but there you go. Maxed out. One copy of that maxed out. And uh, since we didn't get to see so in our crazy. copy of Yasuke, I, I could just kind of show her off right here just so have proof. Here, Yonsuke. All maxed out already. Yeah, because I've been working on her ever since I got her from Anime Expo. But. Yeah, I've been trying to kind of play around with her and get used to using her. Getting an additional copy would have been nice, but I guess this is what I'm going to have to go with. Okay, so now that we're done with that, um, before I want to do the Oberon uh, summons, there's other summons I want to do. I want to do some of the guarantee summons. So, you know, those sync cords I've been talking about saving for a long time is literally just for moments like this where I could spend it on... A guaranteed summon and yeah there's a lot to decide it's kind of cool because you could um you could 
probably most likely get who you're trying to go for. At least you have a really high chance here compared to any other time, right? But, um, you know, I actually have a lot of these servants and I already have my bases covered. And I think the only thing that I really want at this point is just more copies of Morgan Le Fay and Castoria. Um, and if I get the other three, that'd be nice as well. So I'm going to go with this and see what happens. There we go. I mean, it's pretty much, you know, two out of five chances. It's a pretty good chance. But of course, there's going to be always um, some junk in there. I'm just debating on whether I should skip it, but I already know they're, you know, it's guaranteed. They're going to be in here. And I'm afraid if I get quick too much, I might just die. Oh! And it's probably cast three. Yeah, cool. Work off is that mean more bigger buffs. So my whole art team is even more stronger than they are now. But that doesn't mean that's the only one I can still possibly get more. So it was a long shot. Hector, as always. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna click it. Is that enough? Yeah, they show four stars enough when you click on it. Skip the three stars. I think. They, if the click actually worked. It's a three star click. Oh! This is extra, right? An extra one. Who would it be? Ooh. Wait. I think you're already maxed already. <laughs> I think I already have her maxed, but okay. We'll worry about that about that all later. You guys don't need to know what I'm gonna do with Castoria. I think it's pretty obvious. Um where are we now? At this point, probably the talk of the town, Oberon. So, Oberon is a really powerful buster buffer. I mean, Kionska is pretty important because she's kind of helps with the whole NP problem buster characters have. But Oberon is where you get most of your damage from. Um, and I think if I remember right, like I haven't looked into him too deeply, right? Just very briefly. He kind of focuses on, you know, doing a lot of damage in one turn. So you usually just pull him out as your like wild card. Last resort. Just the turn to kind of do a big nuke. Um, and of course, I think uh, Merlin is a good alternative for him. So. Since I have Merlin, I actually don't need Oberon so badly. Which is why I'm really debating on whether I should somehow or not. But he's such he's such a strong buffer. I mean, just because I have Merlin doesn't mean I can't also try to Oberon somehow. Um But, you know, I I seen or heard people who skipped on Oberon did regret not rolling for him, so it kinda makes you think. Um but at least I know that it doesn't hurt at least to do one temple. So let's go ahead and do that at least and see what happens. 
Oberon Saints Craft for Stage 3 Ascension and Hyra is locked. By completing the... Oh, wow. Okay, so you're, you're holding Oberon hostage. Hmm. It's fair. It just means I'm eventually going to have to eventually catch up in the game. I've been so bad at catching up in FGO, but, you know, I will get there eventually. For now, let's go ahead and do at least at least one ten pull. See how this goes. Oh, that's literally it. Wow, really <laughs> disappointing. Okay. Yeah, I don't really want to spend any more quartz. But what I can do is go ahead and do at least like 20 ticket pulls. Because in the end, there are still more, a couple more servants I'm kind of looking forward to and I want to make sure I have enough of them. Though my Kionska pulls are pretty lucky, you can't um, get too complacent. So I was going to have a bunch saved up for future servants. Oh, well, I said five star C that I think I have plenty of already. And I think it was the okay one too. Like one that I never use. Yeah, majority of the C's in case you really don't use. Like they, they kind of either need, they usually always need like a heavy gain. And all into like attack stat. And some kind of like, you know, attack buff. And then you will also have some couple of support ones that kind of gives you crit stars or crit generation. But yeah, this is the double. I was like, wait, more. Yeah, that's a good indicator to let you know that you rolled 10 times. So, wow, 10 pulls already went through already. Very quick. And yeah, nada. Nothing too crazy. Yeah, I guess my luck just ends here at the point after getting all those um, five star C's I was after. And I'm kind of mad because I don't even get to show off uh, how I got Kionskia. Literally, it was like on the 10th pull that I got her. Oh, we got a new 4-star C. What's this do? It's funny, it feels like there's like a Rin 4-star C already, and this is another one, I guess. Do begin with the MP charge. This actually might not be too bad. We managed to max it out, though. Okay. Pushing on. Maybe like about three more pulls left. What? Oh, last one. I, all these pulls are so bad. <laughs> I don't know where I want to end up like that. <laughs> Just the, I guess the Castoria would be Kali. I should have saved that for last, but I don't know. I don't want to end up like that. I want to get at least something, like a four star or something. You know what? I don't want to think I have this four-star girl, so we'll, we'll we'll roll until we get either Ron or her. How about that? Okay, skipping. 
All the three stars. Don't want to see those. Okay, I don't want to see this either, but... Okay, this is what I want to see. It's not him. His card is like, um... A... Alright, I think I have her already. From the gun scale roll. Hmm... A new character. Wait a minute. That other four star character, I don't think I have her yet, right? Yeah, I don't think I have her yet. Okay, I guess we'll go until we get her or Oberon. Oh my god, maybe I shouldn't have promised that much. No. Well, it keeps going. Oh, um, but it's just more CEs that I have already. Oh, um, it's kind of looking bad. It <laughs> really. My instincts are telling me not to the, the roll anymore, just to stop. It's just to, like, you know, kind of pull away before, like, it gets worse. I can't afford it. I think I can afford it. I can afford, like, a couple more times. Should have just ended it with the, the four star server I got earlier. Oh! At least a four star servant? Tristan! Do I have him? I don't have him. Okay. I got the other Tristan. You know, the, the Jenner bent one, which I don't know much about. Enterprise You know what? I think I'll take it. This is where I'll end it. I'll go with. Wait. So it looks, tell me more about. Seth? I see. Story summon servants. Okay, so I was not tripping. I was like, I could have sworn this character looked familiar. That's literally the gen event. Tristan, that we see right there to the right. So technically, I got something even better. Um, okay. So, yeah, no extra copies of Kionska and no, you know, first copy of Oberon, but I'll take <laughs> take what I have right now and um, save for the future roles in the FGO. And hopefully, hopefully in the future, be caught up. I mean, even if I get over, I probably couldn't use them for a while anyways until I actually caught up in the story. So, it's probably better for me to kind of, you know, wait in the future when I have more to spend and roll all the other characters that I want first before I roll for him again. So, I guess, I guess that's what we will have to do. So, if you guys are planning to roll for Oberon or any of the previous banners, I kind of wish you guys luck. No, I will wish you guys luck. You guys aren't going to need it. Um, yeah. It's just... The rates... Sometimes you forget the rates for, like, fake Grand Order is, like, really, really rough. But... That's 
why you just have to save a lot and be prepared for the worst. And there is still that pity mechanic, I guess, when you roll enough that you will eventually be guaranteed to get the character. Like, I forgot how many? 329 summons? Yeah, like how many times I summon today? Most, like a little under 100, but not enough for me to kind of go the rest of the way. Yeah, it's still better for me just to save it up and spend it on another character that I really want so badly. But yeah, hopefully you guys don't have to hit that month just to, to kind of get LeBron. All right, it's very late. Um, so I'm gonna go you know, probably get some sleep. Well, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Coco Neko signing out. Bye-bye.